Coming up this week on The Archer's Choice. We're going down to Florida to hunt some hogs. And I'm going to kill one. You're going to do what? Kill one. He gets that from his mother. Here, tell us what's going to happen. <laughs> <laughs> oh, I knew you were up to something. <laughs> This is the Archer's Choice. Welcome to this week's Archer's Choice. And this week, well, one of the fastest growing parts of hunting mm -hmm. is hog hunting. That's right. Well, hog hunting is so much fun. And actually, when we get asked, you know, my wife, she shoots a bow, she shoots a gun, but she just doesn't know if she can go ahead and take a deer. Yeah. yeah. I go, go hog hunting. They're ugly. They're ugly. Anyone ugly. can shoot at them. That's it. No That's licenses. It. Yeah. That's right. Year round. Yep. And mo almost every place you go to, it's a nuisance. That's right. They, they make devastation across the fields, rooting up all the fields and everything. They tear it's it up bad. bad. Yeah. This week's lucky logo is scent lock. If you happen to see the scent, scent lock. lock lucky logo, oh. then you need to, at the end of the show, we'll tell you what you need to do. Yeah, because you won't so. be able to smell it. You just got to see it. Okay, so anyways, we have three girls and one guy hunting on this show. So let's just get into my hog hunt. Hers. Mine. Figures, doesn't Mine. it? Mm -hmm. Hers first. Of course. The princess. Hey, watch it. See who shoots a bigger hog. Okay, we spotted these hogs when we were camping in this morning. We got in a position here. They're just down this hedgerow here with these bell meadows. We just got to get around the curve there and see if we can get a shot of them. Look at this. She's a beautiful pig. Big long snout on her. She's got a thank Hoppy. Thank Ralph for coming out and filming me this morning. Let me shoot a bigger pig than him. And of course, thank the big guy upstairs for me put a good shot on her and not having her suffer at all. Congratulations. That, that was Thanks. a good hog. It was. And you know what? She's really good eating and spawning and stalking. That's a lot of fun. That's what it's all about. It is. Well, we you want guys. It facing that way. Okay. You don't want to go anywhere because when we come back, 
Kelly and Donna, their hog hunts are coming up. So don't go anywhere. We'll save Ralph's for last. The best. You got it? The last. We're okay. Welcome back to the Archer's Choice. Well, now it's time for Kelly. Do, what do you got there? Lots of photos. Oh, ah, okay. And Donna's turn, Donna Marino. You know, and they're both hunting out of the Ameristep ground blinds, but the That's big right. thing was is it's Ke Fern Duquette. If you remember from Capture Boy Outpost, Outpost where he moves hunt every year. Yep. This is his daughter and her first it's hunt. Her first hunt that she's going on. Dad brought her down, down to Hoppies and go hog hunting with her bow. She's so excited. So watch these. Can I see that? No, nope, this is mine. Well, mine. Don't you have the other one to put in there? Did you forget it back at the office? I forgot it. Well, here we are at uh, Hoppy's place in Florida. I've got my daughter, Kelly Duquette, with me. This is going to be her first hog hunt, first big uh, hunt with the bull. She's been practicing a lot, and I think she's ready for it. It's going to be a whole lot of fun. We were here last night, and we just looked at the hogs, checked to see what they do, and uh, I think she'll, uh, she'll do well with it. Isn't it amazing how many color phases these hogs come in? Just think, you could start collecting all the color phases. I'm gonna put out some of this Seymour hogs. I've been hearing a lot of good things about it. I want to check it out for myself and see if it works. Brings in more pigs, so we'll give it a go. I'm set up in my blind and I have sprinkled out some Seymour hogs. And I'm really anxious to see how well that product works. I've heard a lot of good things about it. Time for this week's Bow Hunting World Magazine Tip of the Week. This week's Bow Hunting World Tip of the Week is making memories last a lifetime. Real simple, real cost effective, and fast. This is a complete European skull kit that you can mount sheds or broken skull plates or you just want to take your rack, rack off and put it on a skull. It's so simple. Take your rack. One of the things is you get, you actually get two different skull plates. So if the antlers are like Vicky's, you need a smaller one. If the antlers are like mine, you need a bigger one. My tree productions, he makes a complete skull, a whole European mount out of plastic, and you could do this in 10 minutes at your house without any fancy tools. That's it. You just made memories last a lifetime. Now hang it up on the wall and brag. Tell everybody, wow, look how big that deer is. That is your bow hunting world tip of the week. Well, seeing as how Ralph forgot to bring back the rest of the SD cards so we could fill up all of our stealth cams, he had to run back to the studio and get them. In the meantime, you don't want to go anywhere because when we come back from the commercial break, we'll see how Kelly and Donna really did on their hunts. Vic, I got the stupid cards. Now let's get back to Donna and Kelly's hunt.
now. <laughs> you got the one you're after. Holy man. That's what we came for. <laughs> <laughs> oh. That was probably more exciting for me. <laughs> I know, you're shaking. <laughs> well, it's Kelly's first hog. Nice little guy. It was a whole lot of fun. The shot was a little higher than we would have liked to have seen it. Sometimes that ha happens hunting and uh, nerves can kick in. But she got the one she was after and I'm proud of her for it. <laughs> Another great trip to Hoppy's place in Florida. Are you starting to feel pressure? Three girls on one show, hogs going down. Hopefully we'll see how you can do it. That's it. Oh man, look at it. Oh, cool. That'll be some good eating, huh? <laughs> good shot, Donna. Thank shot. you. Well, Kelly, Donna, Kel, congratulations. you go girls. That was yeah, awesome. Yeah, Donna, wasn't it? You're, you girls are doing good. We are. Do you think you can hold up your own there? Ain't not. I ain't worried one bit. You ain't worried anyone? I ain't worried one bit. Well, that's good. Don't go anywhere. We'll see if Ralph can, you know, pull enough for the guys. Come on. By the way, this vine here, let's not hang the stealth cam on that tree. No. Itchy. I'll be like this, like in a couple days. <laughs> Welcome back to the Archer's Choice. Well, I think we should find a tree without the vine. Yeah, I don't want to be okay, looking now like that. It's your turn. Yep, it's my turn. You know what? what what's saying? Save the best for last. So, what are you going to do? Then we have to play this backwards. Hoppy, Hoppy spot. We spotted these hogs from way across the field. Right. They're on that hog wild that we put. Yeah, I put it out yesterday. I dumped all that stuff in the palmettas right there. Um, you see them down there? Yeah, they're still there. All right, let's go. Shot. Holy cow. We're close. 
Six yards? Yeah. I don't even know. <laughs> I'll bet you one even it, it ain't ten. I put that bit on and I'm like, okay, I better come lower, 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 lower. He didn't go anywhere. Oh no. I think that's what they call Barbie. Barbecue. Spitfires, baby. Spitfire. Worked real well at the range we were shooting. Yes, they work real, real well at any range. You wanted to get up close to one, didn't you? I did. I wanted to get as you close did. as we possibly could. You did. And as long as you know you didn't booger them, you didn't. Yeah. We did okay. One time it peeked up and looked at you, yeah. but I think this younger hog, if it had been the big sow that peeked up and looked at you, I think she'd have took off. Oh, buddy. Whew. Oh my gosh, look what you're standing in. <laughs> that it right there is a barbecue. That's huh? a perfect one. That's a perfect size. Perfect I mean, deal. really, the guys that have been down here hunting with me know that this is a perfect size, but most people who book a hunt and come down, they're looking for a big boar yeah, want, or a big hog. But you have that. You, you know, you take two <laughs> hogs, right? But if you, you, when you start eating wild hogs, this is you it. will learn that this is the, the or even smaller, is the perfect, the perfect really one to eat. Oh yeah, yeah, this is, this is good right here. We'll put this on the smoker. Perfect, perfect. All Thank right. you. Well, I think you found a tree that you can lean on without getting poison ivy or oak. Yes. I, I could put my arm here. I'm That's not good. afraid. I'm well, congratulations on your pig. Thank you. You know, it's, it's, it's like Hoppy. We, we all call them the Barbie for barbecues. Barbecues. Because, I mean, that's a perfect size, even a little smaller. That's good eating. Is, that's it. You can put that whole thing on there and feed a whole family and just have a party. That's what we want to thank Hoppy Kempfer and Osceola Outfitters for having us down there again. Donna, and, and especially not only Kelly, but Fern, as a father taking his, his daughter out. I that's mean, that's, right. That's our future. That's our future, and we need more parents to do that. That's right. That's right. Take the time. Okay, if you happen to see the Scent Lock Lucky logo, you need to log on to archerschoice.com, click on that Lucky Logo button, fill out some information, and someone's going to win some cool stuff from Scentlock. That's it. Yeah, that's pretty Ooh. cool. Woo well, we'll see you next week, same time. Same channel. Right here on, on the, the Archer's, Archer's Choice. Choice. Give me the cards. Well, I'm going to go hang, put a couple no. more. No. Give me the I cards. I want to put a couple more cameras up.